It's Bonnie. Happy Good Friday. I'm on a roll with videos. I got one more after this. We got to talk about Yankee Candle Gnome Jelly Bean. Holy cow, this is a powerhouse for Yankee. I got to say, I am really liking this candle. It's got a little bit of a pooling issue, but the scent is actually really, really good. So... Yankee Candle did a small Easter release this year. A couple things going on. Um, the strawberry, where did it go here? Um, they have the Strawberry Bunny Shortcake back. A couple of other Easter scents. I did a whole video. I actually like this one. This one is not a bad one from Yankee. And then the one that really appealed to me was the gnome jelly bean and i'm hearing from a couple people that it's on sale right now in store um so now might be a really good time to pick this one up so the jar is a beautiful purple oh my gosh look at the jar you know how much i love gnomes and this easter gnome is making me really happy um by the way i gotta talk about the Mother's Day bag after this. I, oh my gosh, I don't like the Mother's Day bag this year. It's just kind of weird, but we'll, we'll get into the Mother's Day bag in a minute. <laughs> I'm enjoying the gnome jelly bean. <laughs> so um, the side notes on here are cherry, green apple, nectarine, pineapple blossom, and the base is sugar. Oh my gosh, it's such a nice blend of like the cherry, the apple. It's very fruity. Um, and it's very sugary. You know me, I love my sugar. <laughs> so check it out. Um, I've had this one going, believe it or not, for almost three hours now. And I'm still not getting like a full wax pool. I'm worried it's going to tunnel. I cannot find my Illumilid. I just, I don't know, I put one somewhere and I, I, I didn't get an Illumilid on this thing. And if I don't use the lid, I usually have pulling issues. So what it's kind of doing is it's just kind of like sinking down a little bit in the middle and then it's waxing up around the outside, which sometimes does happen with these single wick Yankees. I actually prefer um, that Kringle does the two wicks because you do get a lot more heat with, um, oh, that's my Yankee. Where the heck did I put my um, Kringle? Do I have one up here? Oh, here it is. Um, no, that's my Yankee too. I've been moving stuff around, you guys. I like the way Kringle does their two wicks, though, because like I said, you get a lot more heat in there. Very rarely burn these um, without the lid, but you know what? It's it's worth it. Seriously. Um, the throw on this one is so good for a Yankee. I highly recommend you pick this one up if you like fruit, if you like sugar, and especially if you like um, these jelly bean gnomes. I'm, I'm actually impressed. I don't know if this is going to actually continue to burn well all the way down, but um, I'll probably burn this Easter day. I'm actually really excited about this one. So that was really good. I'm I'm definitely on board uh, with the gnome jelly bean. So Yankee Candle also has their Mother's Day tote right now. And I, when I first saw it, I'm like, oh, Mother's Day tote, I'm going to get it. Then I looked at it and I'm like, huh? So I'm going to put a screenshot up. So usually when Yankee does their totes, I always get one at Christmas. You get a wide variety of stuff. You get... Um, a plug-in, you get a lid, you get a votive holder, you get a candle, you get all kinds of cool stuff in the bag. This bag is $45 with a $20 purchase, and the only thing you get is four candles, but you can't pick the candles. So you get the Iceberry Lemonade, which I actually want to try. Um, that one was appealing to me. Um, you get the Lilac Blossom, um, in the country jar, you get the seaside neroli in the woodwick, and then you get um, one of the three wick velvet, peach, and pink lily. The only one that's really appealing to me out of this entire bag is the iceberry lemonade, and I'm like, I'd be better off just buying the iceberry lemonade and forgoing the entire bag and spending the $45, because that's like you know, $11 a candle, which is not a bad price, but they're not the candles I want. I'd much rather get the bag 
with all different kind of neat stuff in there because I always like getting the lid and I always like getting the votive holder. So I don't know. The bag is not appealing to me. I'm not going to get the bag um, this year, but I'm hoping they do a better one in the fall for Christmas because I always get the Christmas bag. I actually love the Yankee bag. So that was a little bit disappointing, um, the Mother's Day tote this year. And I have so many tote bags. I'm like, I don't need another tote. The tote was like, eh, it's okay. A little stripey blue thing going on. It's not terrible. But um, I don't know, it just wasn't super exciting to me. So I'm going to do a no on the bag. But no on the bag, yes on the candle. So if you can find this one, Yankee's doing um, some online deals. It looks like they're buy three original large jars for 52 I don't know if this one counts. Um, the large jars are up to um, $31 now. So unless you get these on sale, they're doing buy one, get one 40% off. I don't think that's a great deal. But if you go into the store and they're doing a deal on these, I would definitely pick up um, the Easter one just because the scent, the scent on this is wonderful. It's that fruity, um, jelly bean, you know, cherry, all kinds of neat scents going on. It's sugary and the throw is great. So yay, yay Yankee for doing that. And I like the color and I like the jar, but I got to get a, I got to get a lid on here because it's doing the weird waxy thing. So anyway, oh my gosh, you guys have an awesome evening. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.